We do know that Booker is a Topeka native, so KSNT News' Caitlin Berry went to find out more about him. She joins us live now with details about Booker's background. Caitlin? Jared, we now know Booker Jr. went to school here at Topeka West. I also went to the parents' house this afternoon, and neighbors tell me he was involved in junior ROTC while in school. I also had the chance to speak with Booker's father briefly, and this exclusive video shows what he had to say. John did not live here. Okay. Okay? I will make sure that get out clearly, okay? I appreciate it if you make sure that put out publicly, okay? Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, can, you, can you help direct us in the right direction then? Where was yes. he staying? Uh, he was staying with my nephew. I don't even know where that is. You don't know where that is? Okay. Um, um, I talked to John about at least four times within the last year. Okay. You okay. know who might you know, who might be good to talk to, who might just know him, just be able to give us a bit of information? Well, about. my nephew, but I don't, I don't talk to him that much. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Do you have his contact information? No. Uh, my wife do, but she don't want to talk right now. Okay. My wife do almost communication to him and the kids. I'm a veteran. Mm -hmm. I disagree with what happened. I'm upset right now. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. I also spoke with a number of neighbors who say they didn't hear or see much from Booker Jr., who's pictured here in a photo posted to Facebook. No neighbors wanted to speak with me on camera, but several Topeka community members say they're surprised to learn someone from here at home would be involved with a terrorist organization. I'm shocked, I guess, that anyone here would uh, have the um, values that they have, or maybe I should say lack of values that they have. Others say with the internet today, unfortunately, it's something that could happen anywhere. Everybody's online and everybody's, uh, and, and ISIS is worming its way into companies' uh, computer systems and uh, taking over their computer systems, and, and obviously they're getting the information about soldiers and uh, publishing that information, so I don't think it's uh, impossible at all. I did speak with one neighbor who says her children grew up and went to school with Booker and his twin brother. She says his parents are wonderful people and she's shocked that he would have any involvement with ISIS. Live in Southwest Topeka, Caitlin Berry, KSNT News. Thank you for that report, Caitlin. We'll continue digging to learn more about the storage locker Booker allegedly kept full of explosives right here in Topeka. Go